Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a video on my face collection. Um, there's just going to be like really parts, but like in this one I'm going to show you guys like my blushes and highlighters and bronzers. Then in a separate video I'm going to be showing you guys foundations, powders, concealers, and yeah. So, I'm just going to get started and show you guys before I run out of time, and my fans are great there. So, um, I'll first get started off with just cream blushes or highlighters. For highlighters, I only have ones from e.l.f., and these two, I'm going to, every time I mention these in the video, I'm always going to say this, that I heard these are a dupe of High Beam from Benefit, so like in the store, I'm going to one day bring this with me, like when I go to Sephora one day, I'm either going to bring this one with me or this one with me, probably this one because it's easier and, you know, smaller, yeah, kind of, um, and swatch them side by side, and then I'll do, when I do another video, I'll tell you guys if they're actually the same, but that's what I heard, um, so I'm not really going to recommend this as a, you know, official dupe. But I really like these in general. So uh, the first one that I purchased is this one, which is the All Over Cover Stick. This is like a solid one. This is more of a liquid one. Um, they both work really, really well, and I love the color of it. It's so pretty. It has like really nice, you know, shimmer in it. So that's it. It's like a lilac color, of course. And these just go on really smoothly, and you're supposed to put it either. Um, you can use it as blush. That will look really gorgeous. Or as a highlight, I like it as a highlight better just because it's really, really shimmery. So yeah, that one, and since, because the first time I ordered it was like around Christmas, and yeah, so I purchased this one, then my other purchase from e.l.f., I had to purchase the liquid one just because I think it would be, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say a backup because they're two different like consistencies, but I don't know. So this one is the, called the Shimmering Facial Whip, and these are like liquid, um, you know, highlighters. So it comes with a little thing like that. And it's like a liquid. So, see that? They kind of remind me of what are those called from MAC. They're like droplets. I don't even know what they're called. But it, I don't know why it reminds me of them. So, yeah, but they're the same color. Um, the shimmery facial is so much more like shimmery. Like, look at how, you know. But they're both really pretty and they smell like oranges. Um, yeah, so if you have sensitive skin, which I do, um, I don't really use those that often, but I love them anyway. So, yeah, I can't use, like, fragrance items on my face just because it's kind of going to make me, cause me to break out. But, yeah, I really like those. Um, okay, so that's for, okay, so now I'm going to show you guys cream blushes. That was kind of like a little pause there. I have two of them. These are my favorite blushes, and I love them. So first, let's start off with this one. This is Maybelline Dreamless Blush, number 40, Soft Plum. And... This is like a rosy color, and it has some um, pretty much silver glitter. I wouldn't say glitter, but like shimmer in it. The color is not really showing up that well, but it's such a gorgeous color. Color. Um, so, yeah. And I love the packaging because if you're going like on a, what's it called? If you're going on a trip, it's really small and compact. Not really compact. Really small. So, it would fit in your bag. Then the next thing, I love these. Like, um, these are highly raved about, and I'm like, they're so raved about. Hopefully, like, they work as they say they would. Um, this is a NYC Blush Bowl Cream Stick in South St. Seashell. I would totally recommend this to you guys. This looks really, really scary on camera, actually. It is kind of scary in person. I was really, you know, skeptical about getting this. But it's basically, like, it's, like, kind of matte. Here, yeah, I'll put it right next to Taylor Lautner for you. Um, it's kind of um, rosy as well, but it's really pretty. It gives my skin a really nice flesh tone look. Uh, I wouldn't say raspberry look. I would kind of say rosy. So, yeah, but this is so blendable, and I just love it. I apply with my fingers, but hand sanitizer. Just make sure that every time you put a cream blush on, when you apply it with your fingers, make sure your fingers are always clean. You can either wash them or put hand sanitizer. I do both. Um, so, yeah, I like to wash them better just because I feel more safe while putting it on. Um. So yeah, those are my cream blushes. Now I'll start off with e.l.f. just because it's like right next to me. And I'm sorry for the lighting in this video, it's kind of bad, but yeah. So I have two from the studio line and I love these like a lot. These are very buildable as well, so like at first it's just going to be like a little kind of wash of color, but then you can build it up and get more color. So this first one is called Peachy Keen and I love this a lot because it's really good for every day just because it's a really pretty peach color. Like. I don't know if you guys can see. See that color? It's just really pretty. Um, 
I don't know why this reminds me of my MAC blush in a lot of ways, but it's really nice. And I love the packaging of it, too. This next one is called Candid Coral. Um, I wouldn't say it's a coral color just because it's, like, I don't really know. Like, that's, like, the color. And they both have kind of, like, gold gleam to it. Um, so I love these a lot. Um, and then next, I have the Warm Bronzer Little Compact thing, and this comes, it's basically, you could use them all as, um, bronzers, but they're kind of sheer for me. So I always say this, I love to use, this as a bronzer and these three colors as a blush. It gives you the most beautiful sun-kissed look, and it's just amazing for summer, too, so I love that. Um, next I have Cargo Blu-ray High Definition Makeup, oh wait, this isn't it. That's the pressed powder. They all look the same. Like, look at how exactly the same is. This is the blush highlighter, blush and highlighter in one. And um, I'm sorry if this isn't showing up that well because that's the color. Just the actual sparkles aren't showing up. But it's basically a really pretty subtle, like, peachy color. Not really peach, like pink. Uh, with a lot of gold, like, you know, shimmer. And these are so pigmented. And I just love this so much like I love it that's all I could say and they were very pigmented they have a set of this for $11 like go get it $11 compared to 56 I was the first one to grab it so um yeah next is my pink leopard bronzing powder this is a sample size um I told you guys this I think in another video if I didn't I'm giving this to my mom I just want to show you guys this really fast um she had paint on it and it's a really pretty champagne color like this is like the most like shimmeriest like um blush highlighter thing that I have and it's just really really pretty I love it um you can also use them as eyeshadows too but I don't really like to then my next one is a powder and cafe I rave about this all the time in every single one of my videos if I do it on face this goes just as well as sun kiss like if you guys aren't allowed to go on the um order stuff from the internet some of my friends aren't allowed to which is kind of sucks but these two the elf and the nyx cafe blush are both sun kiss finished look like finishing you know, look, whatever, so, yeah, um, then my Jane Shimmer Bronzer in Sedona, and I don't use this a lot, I don't know why, I'm gonna start too, just because it's really, really pretty, and I love it, like, it's really, like, all the blushes and bronzers that I have are really shimmery, so that's why I want to use them, because in the winter, like, I don't, I'm not a big fan of putting really, really shimmery items on my face, really in the summer, because of the sun and all that stuff, um, I don't know if that's it. Well, then I just have this cargo little sample size blush. Looks like this. Oops. Looks like this. It's in Sunset Beach. And this is the striped blushes thingies. Yeah. And I love this a lot because it's like a really pretty coral color. Like orange. It doesn't really look good on my skin though. Um, but I save it anyway because I do makeup on other people. So this would be really good to use. And my last two items. Oh, wait. Three items is this Claire's Illuminating Bronzer. I hate this. Please don't get this. It was a total rip off. Like really, when you close it, it's really hard to close because the bristles are going to get stuck. But it has a lot of glitter and I really don't like it. And it has an on and off button. It's off right now and it's like going crazy. Um, then my Shy Blush from e.l.f. This is their e.l.f. Radiance Blusher in Shy. And this is just a really nice wash of color for me. It just shows up like um, shimmer, which I really like. Just a really nice, you know, neutral kind of blush, I guess. And lastly is my MAC Blush, Sheer Tone Shimmer Blush in Trace Gold. This is just the most prettiest color ever. I love it. That's all I could say. That's the exact color. So it kind of looks scary in here, but not really. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this. Definitely watch my other video. This is my second video because I'm going to upload this video, my other video. So three videos are going to be uploaded tonight. So definitely go check them out. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So um, definitely request any other videos you want me to do. Comment, rate, subscribe. Yeah, so I'll see you guys later and have a great day. Bye.